Hello, my friend. Welcome to my channel. Happy birthday, Gina Rose. A purple smushy mani with some stampin'. I started off with Glitter Be Gone, and I'll be using Color Club Date with Destiny as my base color. And here we go. I've already got my base coat on and dry, and we're going to go in with Date with Destiny. I'm just going to do one coat today because this is just my base for my smushy. There we go. Smooth it all out. Cap that free edge. There we go. And a little bit more straightening, smoothing out. There we go. I'm going to top it with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. Get it to dry down. Give it a nice smooth base for my smushy. My birthday smushy. Being sure to cap that edge with the top coat too. So there we go. I'm going to be using Protect Peel around my digits. I'll be using the Color Club Date with Destiny again. That's going in the smushy. As well as this Color Club. It's called It's a Mystery. Another hollow. And then we got this like duochrome. This one's called Meteor Right. And then finally we have this one with some like shimmeriness in it and it's called Kiss My Astrology. That's gorgeous. So I'm just going to put little drops down here on my little mat, um, my little silicone mat. Just drops of all the different colors. Just kind of blop, blop, blop. No real rhyme or reason to smushies. You just kind of, you know, Toss out some polish out here on the mat and smush it all together. Now this one isn't going to be like a lot of smushies where you can just totally see, you know, distinctive patterns or whatever, but it's going to give it some dimension. And I am just reusing all that polish. I'm getting two fingers done with that one little blobby going on down there. There we go. And that's my Shall We Stamp stamper, by the way. I didn't show it. I'm going to go around with the cleanup brush just to make sure I break the seal. If there's any, you know, paint that's connected to the nail and to my latex. <laughs> and I'm using that IMK brush and some pure acetone. And we're going to get this peel off base coat off of here. Oh yes, it's very satisfying not to have to do so much cleanup. <clears throat> but I am going to go in with my cleanup brush and just tidy up just a tiny bit. There's not much to worry with. It's it's so much nicer when you can use some kind of barrier, latex, tape, or some of the non-latex barriers that are out there now. So there we go. Love this already. I'm going to top it with some quick dry top coat again get it to dry down so we can do some birthday stamping. Gina, I hope you had a wonderful birthday or have a wonderful birthday. I'm hoping to have this up in time for your birthday girl. There we go. So I'm going to be using BMH20, my AliExpress stamper, the Nicole Diary Silver NS04 for my stamping and my Beauty Big Bang scraper. And I'm just going to use different images off of this birthday plate here. Um, I'm going to put these candles on my thumb and my ring finger, but the other nails are going to have different images. I love that little candle image. I think it's so cute. Like I said, I'm going to put that on my thumb, and now we're going to go in for the ring finger. Fingernail. There we go. Light's kind of bouncing off of it. Hard to see. Sorry. Now, these are the little cupcakes. I just think they're adorable. They would be really good for some reverse stamping. Fill them in with all kind of colors. That's what I love about stamping. There's so many possibilities. And then I'm going to do these balloons with, like, bubbles or confetti or something over them. I'm going to use that one, I think, on my pinky nail. 
very cute image though. Smush it down good, tap tap, make sure it's sticking. And then finally, we have to have some birthday cake. We're gonna put this birthday cake on my middle nail. Another cute image. There we go. So we're all stamped up now for some posh top coat. I did the cleanup off camera. You guys have seen me clean up so many times. <clears throat> I really did like how this one turned out. I was pretty happy with it, all those different purples. Being sure to cut that free edge there. So happy birthday, Gina. I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, I've got a swatch photo coming up here real soon, like right now. I'd love to hear what you think about my manicure. Leave me a comment down below. And as always, I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon.